Thumbelina. Once upon a time, there was a kind woman. She wanted a child, but her dream never came true. One day, a fairy came to visit her with a magic seed. The fairy told the woman, "Plant the seed in a pot and see what happens." The next day, the seed became a flower. Inside the flower was a tiny girl. Because she was shorter than a thumb, the woman named the pretty girl Thumbelina. The woman made Thumbelina a cradle out of a walnut shell and picked a rose petal for her blanket. One dark night, an old toad hopped into the woman's house. The old toad took Thumbelina away because she wanted Thumbelina to be her son's bride. The old toad put Thumbelina on a water lily leaf. "You're going to marry my son," said the old toad. "What? What? What? You're so pretty," said the son, looking at Thumbelina. Then the toads went back to decorate their house for the wedding. Thumbelina was so scared that she began to cry. Why are you crying? Asked the fish. I don't want to marry the toad. Said Thumbelina. Don't cry. I can help you. Then the fish chewed off the water lily stem, and a leaf floated down the river. Thumbelina was free. It was winter. Thumbelina wandered in a forest and felt very cold and hungry. Suddenly, she saw a cabin. She knocked on the door. A kind mouse invited her in and gave her food. The mouse let Thumbelina stay as long as she was willing to keep the cabin clean and tidy. Thumbelina found a swallow on the ground. The swallow was sick, and Thumbelina took care of it. The swallow got better day by day, and Thumbelina was happy. The swallow felt grateful to Thumbelina. Thank you, little girl. I can fly now. See you around," said the swallow, and flew away. One day, a mole visited the mouse. It was the mouse's neighbor. He wanted to marry Thumbelina. The mouse liked the idea because the mole was very rich. Let's prepare your wedding clothes," the mouse told Thumbelina. But Thumbelina didn't want to marry the mole. She didn't like to live underground forever. She was very sad. <laughs> Finally. The wedding day arrived. Just as Thumbelina was leaving with the mole, the swallow came back. Tweet tweet, I'm going south. Will you come with me? Asked the swallow. Sure, said Thumbelina. They flew up to the sky, across the seas, and over the mountains. Finally, they came to Flowerland. There are many fairies living in beautiful flowers. The swallow told Thumbelina, "Don't be afraid. You're safe here." Thumbelina saw a handsome man with a crown and a pair of wings. 
He was the king of the flower fairies. They fell in love with each other and got married. Thumbelina became the queen of Flowerland. She also got a gift, a pair of wings. The king and queen lived happily ever after.